Ugandans could benefit from a price subsidy for clean energy technologies if the initiative come to pass. The subsidy program seeks to address barrier pertaining to the cost of acquiring clean technology by household enterprises. One of the key challenges of accessing these clean and modern energy services is the affordability challenge. Uganda Energy Credit Capitalization Company has entered into contingent grant allocations with 67 companies. These 67 companies have agreed to be able to discount the products that are eligible uh, so that the public can be able to afford and uh, change their lives through uh, use of uh, off-grid solar for lighting and charging and through use of uh, clean cooking solutions that can be able to preserve our environment. To combat usage of fake products, the Uganda National Bureau of Standards has certified 67 companies to distribute quality energy efficient products. All 67 companies that we are mentioning, and the list is also continuing to grow, uh, they have been subjected to uh, an evaluation, a technical evaluation uh, comprising of uh, they have been, this has been done by a committee, a committee which also included uh, the Standards Bureau. And so we feel assured that these uh, products uh, that we are selling under this program at discounts will be able to meet the test of time. Um, we, have, we started in a soft way uh, from first uh, November, and so these sales uh, have already started to go on. It's on a first-come, first-served basis. From the recent statistics, only 4% of households in Uganda use clean energy. The Uganda Energy Credit Capitalization Company Initiative is part of government's plan to address climate change and related challenges. Betty Ndagire, NTV Business.